Welcome. We're going to do 10 Kuroks as quickly as we can that are very easy to get at the start of the game, starting around Lookout Landing. So Kurok number one is right here. Pick up the rock. Yaha, yeah. you found me. Kurok number two, here is in Hyrule Castle Town Ruins. Drop a flint or generate fire or do wind and pick up the rock. Yaha, yeah. yeah, you found me. Kurok number three is in the center of Central Square. Pick up the rock. <laughs> That's three for three rocks we've got going on. Yaha, yeah, you found me. Kurok number four is on the east side of Hyrule Castle Town Ruins. This one, you need to use Ascension to go through the Kurok stump. Yaha, yeah, you found me. Kurok number five is even further east, right here. You need to use a arrow or a weapon and break that pot. Yaha, yeah, you found me. Five down, five to go. Kurok number six is right by this bridge. If you get here, you can look through and break the pot. Yaha, yeah, you found me. Number six. Kurok number seven is on this island. All around this fountain, there's a little moat that's going around. Find it, and yaha, yeah, you found it. Seven down. Kurok number eight is at the Helmhead Bridge. On the north side, there is a Kurok acorn. Yaha, yeah, you found me. Two more. Kurok Seeds 9 and 10 is going to be a reuniting right here. We're going to talk to the Kurok. Hey, can you bring me to my friend? He's right there. So you can build a boat or you can build a plane. We're going to give this guy a front row seat to a rocket ride. Let's go. Nice, that's looking good. Now we're going to kill the velocity of our little plane here. Grab him off. No, stop, stop. Okay. Looks like an Octorok got us a little bit. And there is seeds nine and 10. So hopefully these 10 are very easy to do in the early game. And they're all in a line starting from Lookout Landing. 